Alright, so we have eight minutes to get to the end of the level here. Oh shit, I must fell off. That would have really sucked. So again, I'm not gonna try and, I'm gonna make it look as though I'm not speeding, speed running through the game, because I'm not. I'm not intending to do that, but again, with, with the world, I, did, I thought that spring was a lot, further, uh, lot closer to me than there. Um, but again, I kind of, man, that's annoying. That's the second time, whoa. Homing attack falls a bit short. Oh, and again. God, the homing attack kind of has a bit of a shorter range at times. It can, it can do that. It's, it's not a fault of the game, I guess. I, I guess the homing attack was too easy in Adventure 1, and they wanted to kind of give it a bit more of a range so you didn't have to, like, mash it all around and just get easy easy destroying old kills or whatever you want to call them. I, I, I doubt you kill these things. But easy, easy hits, let's, let's call it that. But yeah, I'm just gonna take my hits and take my licks and take my depths and try to get back into the magic as quickly as possible. I'm not saying I'm a master of the game, but I've played it so many times to know where probably about 90% of the stuff is and what about 80% of the tricks are. Um, there is one power-up that I might have to get off camera and that's one of Knuckles's. Um, but I'll explain more about it when we get there. I know, I think I know what level it is, but I don't know where it is exactly. I might have to use uh, that Sonic Dude's playthrough to find it, because I think he picked it up. But you won't miss anything, it's just for that, because I don't actually know where it is, and it, it will be very useful. I can never make that, um, spring. I can never do that one. I need to kind of jump on there, and there's me trying to destroy the robot and hit it. Like, what the hell? Now bear with me, I know there's a kind of a falling part stage here, but I can't remember the life of me what it is. Uh, what the, uh, what the kind of, what's the word? Um, the way, the way to do it is, basically. I hate it when the robots do that. They appear right before you walk into them. Sometimes you can like hit them just randomly and not know about it. I think for this part we go left to right. I think. I'm not certain of it though. No, it's right to left on the spring. It's just right on the spring rather, but we did it. Did it first time. I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do that. Because I can't remember the life of me what it is. Ah, much better. A B. But yeah, I'm no, I'm no way saying I'm a master at the game, but I've played it so much. Because I enjoyed it. I like I like this game so much. It's my all time second all-time favorite Sonic game. So, I have played it so much, so I know where most of the stuff is, not everything. So in no way am I saying I'm a master of the game. That I'm not. I'm not a master of any game at all. So, oh, this one, this one can be a bit of a, a nightmare of a Snuckle stage, because it's kind of big. I think, I think Knuckles stages are a lot larger in this game than they were in the adventure, uh, the original adventure. And these ones can be quite time consuming. I think, I think Knuckles' last level is probably the most difficult of all of them. And you've got the Shovel Claw. Right. B to look apparently. Twin huts. Oh god damn it. I don't want to look at the screen. That was my fault, sorry. Yep, I did. It was right in front of me. How could I possibly miss it? Well, we, at least we know where that kind of one is with the twin huts. It should define that, I guess. I mean, this level's big enough, so why don't all the emerald kind of pieces flash up, you know what I mean? It's kind of weird. I guess they wanted to make it a bit more difficult, which is fair enough. Watch out with this ghost, they scared the shit out of me as a kid. 
I played it, I was in my like early teens and stuff and this game came out. So in 23 now I would have been about 12, so not a kid but near enough. Somewhere around here. I never understood what that train track stuff actually means. Because there's buttons you press, I don't know whether it changes the direction of the train or what. Okay, it's definitely not that way. Oh fuck, my bad. Can we go down? No. I think it might be on here. Nope, it's not there. Oh, it's down here, there we go, we could go down. Where though? Down there? No, I'm moving on further away. Oh fuck. I knew I'd do that. Um I don't want to use that screen. There's the two huts they were talking about. There we go. Right. Not this music is awesome. Oh shit. <laughs> oh fuck. Um, well, I think one might be in on top of here. Actually, that was rather lucky. I actually thought that they could all be there somewhere. There it is. Perfect score. I might get through this quite rapidly, which is nice. Oh no, no! Grab onto the wall! Shit, kinda glitched out. a bit higher ground for a bit of safety. There we go. Oh shit, watch out for that train. Over there? Will be over here? Might have been. Nope. Not there. One of the one of these again. You can use these for something. I wonder if it's on another one of those uh, things there. Hmm. See how big this level is? Is that train running on air? Might have to use one of the TV screens because I'm not sure where this last one is. I'm kind of, I don't think I've been everywhere. Come on, where is it? There's uh, like pieces in place there. Let's use this. In the center of a triangle. Right. That's not that helpful. This perhaps? Oh, what the hell? I'm jumping all over the place. Man, yeah, this one is tricky. In the 
center of a triangle. That wasn't helpful at all. Oh, hang on a minute. Here we go. Or not. Definitely around there somewhere. 